Hi, love campers. I'm so glad you're here. Today's love adventure is in my favorite place at camp, which is the craft shop. Yay! Look around. Is this amazing or what? We have love glitter and we have silliness glue and we have amusement tape and we have so much fun yarn and all of this is here to serve your love story. So today we are focusing on the magic of letting go. And this is really going to be a great continuation for all the awarenesses that we've already had in our other two days of camp. The first one being the space of possibility, the second one, the awareness of our choice, and the letting go becomes a combination of that because when we are choosing or where we have habits of choosing pain from the past or staying in an old story and not even being aware of it, we continue to create suffering. And when we're keeping ourselves in the suffering and in the past and in the stories and in that kind of feeling of powerlessness and victim mentality sometimes, then we are not able to allow something different to come in. So whatever it is that we might be choosing and really kind of feeling like, well, this is, this is something I can't change, I want to let you know that right now you, you actually can change it, like you can change anything. And your mind, body, and spirit is listening to that right now. So today in the craft shop, we're gonna pull out a piece of paper and collect some of our markers and pens and whatever it is you have handy and just take a moment to settle in and we're just going to start with a simple little creation on our paper. And that is an image of you. Right now, in this moment, and it doesn't have to be something that is like a portrait, a museum quality portrait. It's just something that represents you in this moment. So just doing the best you can and allowing your your being to guide you, your imagination to guide you in picking colors and making shapes and just do something that quickly represents you on the page. And I encourage you to let yourself work swiftly and freely and and really let go of any need to be right or make it perfect. This is really just about a healing practice right now. So putting that image of you on the paper and as you notice you on the paper, just be aware. Your imagination is going to make you aware of something that is in the field around you. So if the whole piece of paper is the field of you, the energy field of you, you begin to become aware of things that are in that space. And let's start with just picking one of those things. And whatever that thing is, whether it's a story from the past or a belief that keeps you feeling kind of heavy and sad or creates suffering for you, just represent it with a symbol, a shape, a line, a dot, 
a swirl, something very simple that you can put on the page with you. So whatever that is, go ahead and put it down. And this represents that thing that has been a distraction for you. You may or may not even know what that is, but you have a sense of the energy of it. So just perceive something that's in your field that is distracting you and keeping you from allowing love to come in. Generally, it's related to our past. So noticing that and putting that on the page. And if you need to pause this and take more time, you can. But now that you have this image of you and the symbol of that which distracts you from having peace in the present moment, now just take a moment to just meditate for a second just by closing your eyes and taking some breaths and just as you breathe you can even stare at this image as you take a moment to stare at this image sensing being aware of how whatever this is has been keeping you from having more in your life. And then becoming aware of that symbol, whatever it is that you put down that represents that story, that past, that belief, that habit. And as you stare at it, it begins to transform into something else. Something that wants to contribute to your love story. And just notice what it starts to become. Maybe it becomes just a different color in your mind. Maybe it ex has some light rays or, or has sparkle, or maybe it's a, a square that turns into an amazing gift or a squiggle that turns into a magical, beautiful vine that creates fresh smelling flowers for you and nurtures your life. Whatever it is, it doesn't have to make sense at all, but you'll just notice that whatever comes through is coming through in service of love and in service of you. So whatever's coming through comes through with this lightness, with this, with this space of possibility and just allow your imagination to work through you and inspire the different colors, the different materials, whatever it is, to bring this to life. And it may even expand into the image of you and surround you. Whatever it is, just notice it as it comes forward to gift to you in this moment. And feel free to take more time on this if you like. But now, right now, looking at both of these images or this one image together, and as you look at this one image together, you begin to sense and perceive how this is changing your future. You begin to sense and perceive your future love story as this becomes that nourishment for it. And as you begin to sense and perceive how this 
is different for you, you begin to receive that difference in your body. So receiving from this image, like a stream of colored energy, all that this has for you and brings to your love story and noticing the stream of colored energy coming into your body, noticing where you feel it, where you sense it. And just allowing it as it moves to you, through you, around you. Notice how it expands in your body. Deepens, expands, it grows, it changes every cell of your being so that this is your new reality. And how good it feels to know that today you are different. Today you get to move forward into that space of possibility that you discovered. You get to move forward making new choices. And even in those moments when you you forget this picture, at some point you will remember this picture and you can return back to it. So you'll just continue to practice this new way. And I'm so glad you're here to receive this. Thank you for being here. Have a great day at camp.